We've got improvements to offline capabilities in Power Apps, solutions to some pains in the authoring canvas, and there's a new modern control in town in this month's Power Apps Pulse. Welcome to the Power Apps Pulse, where each month we highlight those quality of life enhancements to Power Apps that improve your maker and user experience. Are you tired of stack panes taking over your authoring canvas? Well, your feedback was heard with the new pane switcher. Now you can expand and collapse the panes that you're working on so that you can switch between the properties, comments, and app checker panes easily without taking up all of that space in your authoring canvas. So you have more room to build. We also have a new in-app notification that lets us know when a local change can't be saved in our offline capable Canvas apps. These offline improvements also allow more time to download Canvas apps assets, improving reliability in our offline capable apps. And we have a handy new cancel sync command in our offline capable Canvas apps to give end users a way to cancel syncing data in the device status page. And now finally, we have some updates to modern controls. The information icon now takes up the full width and height, eliminating all of that extra padding and giving you more flexibility with the sizing of the control. And gone are the days of you painstakingly building out your own custom toolbars, thanks to the new modern toolbar control. This gives you a new modern interface for executing commands and it's configurable for several different scenarios. Just add the toolbar control on your screen and you can stack multiple commands in this one control for a simple and seamless toolbar. Well, that's it for this episode of the Power Apps Pulse. We'll see you next month with more updates.